Small cars are always fun to drive, especially if you're driving on windy roads. Small cars with power-packed engines and a good road grip are all the way more exciting. Besides cars from time to time, tech innovators introduce other small-sized vehicles too like mini planes, bikes, and trucks. Today, let's look at the top 20 smallest vehicles with ridiculously powerful engines. The Badger Assault Tank Say hello to this little tough guy that won the Guinness World Record for being the smallest passenger tank on Earth. Designed by military vehicle veterans How and How, this intriguing vehicle measures 3 feet long and 3 feet wide. The tank is capable of breaking down doors and withstanding blasts. The Badger is indeed a little beast and a great mini-weapon for modern warfare. Just in case you don't believe us, Badger Assault Tank is currently being used by several divisions, United States Army. The Brooch Mopeda With a name like Brooch Mopeda, this small car sounds super classy. Only 14 of the three-wheeled small-sized cars that were made in the 1950s are around to this day. The car has a 50cc engine, three gears, and a handle bow in place of a steering wheel. The vehicle boasts a top speed of 30 miles per hour. It measures 5 feet and 9 inches in length and weighs 187 pounds. When the trend of big powerful cars was on the rise, the production of this tiny thing was halted. Otherwise, it would have been the dream car for many today. A Flying Gravity Jet Suit Super suits are mostly seen in movies, but recently they are becoming a reality. Richard Browning of Gravity Industries recently invented a flying suit. As a kid, Browning grew up making working models of airplanes under the guidance of his aeronautical engineer father. Browning founded his own company in 2017. Now his company has made it possible for normal people to own a jet suit. The flying suit can go at a speed of 32 miles per hour and has an engine that runs on diesel fuel. The suit can soar 12,000 feet in the air. Cool and terrifying. The Mini Kenworth Truck in 2018, an Irish company released a line of mini trucks for little truckers. The automotive company is well staffed with engineers specializing in building heavy machinery. Hence, from time to time, the company also releases realistic heavy machinery replicas and truck toys for children. One of the coolest toys created by the company was the battery powered Scania S730. It can drive just like a real truck and reach top speeds of 3.7 miles per hour. Wow, what a cool toy! The Mosquito XE Named after the insect that has a big bite, the Mosquito XE is an ultra-light helicopter with one seat and no cockpit. This little helicopter uses a compact radial MZ202 engine that carries 12 gallons of fuel. It can go only for 150 miles in one round. Designed by a Canadian company specializing in innovator technology, these copters are sold for only $20,000. Not too expensive for a helicopter if you ask me. The Micro Submarine Submarine vessels are known to be huge, but would you want to take a ride in such a tiny submarine? A talented Ukrainian craftsman, Vasily Shikur, designed and built this small underwater submarine from the ground up with his own hands. Vasily Shikur spent $12,000 on raw materials. The submarine can reach a speed of around 3 miles per hour in water. The little vessel has a bolus chamber and can be submerged up to 328 feet underwater. The World's Tiniest Jeep Well, with this mini Jeep, you'll be able to run all your errands in no time. Bawar Singh from Punjab, India built this small vehicle. Bawar's idea behind creation of this vehicle was to beat the notorious traffic on Indian roads. The vehicle has all the necessary features, including a rear light, a horn, and a steering wheel. The mini Jeep has 125cc Honda Active wheel tires and engine. The small speedy vehicle can reach 40 miles per hour and allows the driver to navigate through small spaces. In the past eight years, Bawar Bawar Singh has made around 18 such mini Jeeps. The good news is, these cost less than a thousand bucks. Pretty cool. The FL's Microjet Compared to ordinary commercial planes that are 160 feet long or private jets that are 32 feet long, the FL's Microjet is only 16 feet long. Despite its small size, this plane can fly 320 miles per hour. It was first designed in the 1970s but has since received numerous safety and design improvements. It is powered by a quantum turbine engine system. The FL's Microjet is a regular participant in air shows and the crowd always gets impressed by its tiny size and immense power. Honda Moto Campo 
This was a folding scooter sold by Honda in the 1980s. The vehicle came in lovely colors like Shetland white, Daisy yellow, and Caribbean red. The Moto Compo was introduced as a trunk bike. The idea behind the vehicle was that the rider would be able to put it in the trunk of his car and take it anywhere. The vehicle had a 49cc two-stroke engine and a 2.5 horsepower. It weighed only about 99 pounds. Can you imagine pulling off a ride on this thing? Let us know. Cry Cry Jet This is a tiny homemade electric battery-powered airplane that can only reach a maximum speed of 162 miles per hour. It first flew at the Green Aviation Show in Le Bourget Airport for seven minutes under pilot Dedier Estein. This unique airplane was funded by a European aeronautics company. This tiny flying machine weighs only 185 pounds and is undoubtedly one of the most amazing aeroplanes out there. Kind of looks like a toy. Flying this plane might be a whole lot of fun. Would you take a ride in such a plane? Jeremy's P-45 Jeremy Clarkson is known for doing crazy, ridiculous, and sometimes downright stupid things. It's no surprise that when he announced he was launching a new invention, everyone was skeptical. What was his invention? Well, a very tiny, freaking awesome car with a quad bike design that could be driven anywhere. The vehicle has an insane roof protection complete with wipers, and it can be fueled easily. This rare, crazy car can be driven anywhere. You can even drive it into shopping malls without worrying about parking. Peel P50. 54 inches long and 41 inches wide, this mini car is listed in the Guinness Book of World Records as the smallest car ever produced. Between 1962 and 1965, only 50 of these tiny cars were made. They came with one problem, though. These vehicles had no reverse gear. These manual cars had a 49cc four-stroke engine, and they reached a top speed of 28 miles per hour, a speed that was probably considered pretty cool during the 1960s. During this time, the car went for something around $8,500. However, in 2016, one of these cars sold for $176,000 at an auction. That's k k k k crazy The Delta Wing Designed by Ben Bobley in 2012, the Delta Wing was produced by Nissan. The engine of this vehicle was a triangular, aeroplane-like shape. The idea behind the unique design of the engine is that it makes the car structurally advantageous and dynamic in terms of speed. The Delta Wing was used on several occasions, but it was never produced in large numbers. The car is now no longer used in races due to regulation changes. What a pity! The car does look like a cool aeroplane on ground. Gen H4 Helicopter Mmm, well, this one looks a bit ridiculous, don't you think? This is the world's smallest helicopter. It was first flown in 1998. The minuscule one-man flying machine was invented by the president of a Japanese technology company, Genai Yanig Sawa. It weighs 155 pounds and can reach a max speed of 55 miles per hour. You can go for about half a mile into the sky on this thing. This flying vehicle has air-cooled four twin cylinders and Gen 125 engines fitting into a central transmission. If you have a spare 30 grand, this minicopter can make your childhood dreams come true. The Lotus LC the Lotus LC is a British two-door, two-seat sports car which was being manufactured by Lotus Cars since the year 2000. This mini vehicle is a rear-wheel drive, mid-engine Roadster. Originally a more hardcore version of the Lotus LC Roadster with a larger engine but possessing several similar features was also launched. If you're a lover of small sports cars and you truly care about driving, the Lotus LC might be just the car for you. The Revi. People loved small cars in the 1960s and the 80s. When this car was released in 2006, it might have been a little too late because by then everybody wanted fast cars. The car boasted several desirable features like compactness, changeability, and environmental friendliness. This Indian-built miniature car boasts a top speed of 42 miles per hour. That's fine when you're driving about in a congested city, but not so good when you want to hit the road. Known as the G-Wiz in Europe, this car can literally be charged like your phone. Unfortunately, this vehicle received a lot of hate and was labeled the worst car ever made. The Volks Jagger. Here comes the smallest jet fighter of all time, the Volks Jagger. 
Also known as the People's Fighter, this emergency fighter plane was powered by a BMW 003 engine. It was designed by Fock Wolf Industries. The plane was lightweight, weighing just around 3,660 pounds. It was able to fly very fast. It boasted a top speed of 530 miles per hour. However, this plane was dangerous to fly. Landing it presented a great risk. Also, manufacturing of this plane was rather hastily done. That led to dips in quality and many of these planes crashed. The Plymouth Superbird But do us a favor, click on that like button to inspire us. Also subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to be inspired by these types of ultimate facts. The Plymouth Superbird was a highly modified, short-lived version of the Plymouth Roadrunner. This vehicle had notable graphics and horn sounds which mimicked the Roadrunner cartoon character. The Plymouth Superbird was almost half the size of a regular car. It was only 9 feet long, but you could still enter the vehicle through the door easily. You may need to watch these again in order to believe what we just did. Daihatsu Kopen while in Japan in 1999, the Daihatsu Kopen is a microcar that can only fit two people. The car was developed by a company named Daihatsu. Daihatsu Kopen is still produced today. Originally, the car was powered by 660cc engine. This engine is quite small and weighs less than a ton. Today, there are different models of the Daihatsu Kopen built with different engines. In the recent years, there has been a steady increase in demand for this car. Small Toe is this the smallest motorbike on Earth? Well, we're not sure. This little vehicle was created by a man named Tom Wilberg. It weighs only 2.4 pounds and has a height of 1.55 inches. It has a top speed of 1.24 miles per hour. The vehicle's engine has a horsepower of 0.3. There are no brakes, no gears, no lights on the vehicle, and all a rider can do is move forward. Would you want to own a pointless motorbike like this one? So, which of these vehicles managed to surprise you? Do you want to ride in one of these? Let us know in the comments. Like always, if you enjoyed, be sure to give us a big thumbs up and leave us some love in the comments section. To keep up to date with all our awesome videos, be sure to hit subscribe and turn your notifications on so you never miss a thing. Until next time, do take good care of yourself.